Hello everyone and thank you for coming back to my channel. I've decided to start a new series where we just walk through some simple things on the website to show a little bit of how to use the website and what features are available because there's an awful lot here but I realize some of it takes some explaining and so this YouTube channel will start to become a resource for tutorials and basically just how to do some things. and. Honestly, it's going to be really informal. I'm going to walk through the website as it is right now. You can see that I'm at fifarosters.com, so this is the live version of the site. And if I run into some bugs or some things that aren't quite perfect, well, I'm going to write them down and try to fix them. And this series will also serve as a good place for me to find bugs and get them fixed. So first things first, we're going to start from the very beginning, starting an account on FIFA rosters. Right up here in the top right, you can see it says sign in, sign up. You click that, it's going to bring up this little window. You can sign in with Facebook. That's a pretty easy way to do it. The other option is to use sign in with FIFA rosters. Also a sign up today. So if you're new to the website, you want to create an account so that you can start tracking your career mode. We'll get to all the benefits of an account later. Uh, but you can see some of them here. You can save your players. You can track your entire team. There's some extra tools and charts you can use. So this brings you to the sign up page. You're going to use uh, an email and you're going to choose your username and a password. And then you would click create account. Sweet, successfully registered. Check your email for an activation code. Well, I used a fake email, so that's not actually gonna show up uh, for me, but uh, I would go and check my email and you'd see a little activation code that would tell you, go to fifarosters.com slash activate. And then when you come here, you would use the same username that you just signed up with and then put in whatever the activation number was and that would be the final step and your account would then be active. So from that point, I would then be able to sign in. Now you'll see my username shows up there and this is actually the team that I currently have active. We're gonna wrap up the video here though for this first step because that is really the biggest first step you need to get started on FIFA rosters. Then you notice you now have a career mode tab in the navigation and there's all sorts of new things you can do as a signed in user. So try it out. If you need help, get in touch with me and I hope you guys enjoy this new series. More tutorials coming soon. Thanks a lot.